Good morning. I am Devasena. In this lecture, we are going to discuss about the key management schemes in wireless sensor network. Management schemes in wireless sensor network. Key management forms the basics of all data security. Here is a representation. The original data is converted into scrambled data with the help of encryption key and with the help of decryption key it is once again retrieved data is encrypted and decrypted via the use of encryption and decryption keys which means the loss or compromise of any encryption key would invalidate the data security measures put into place Keys also ensure the safe transmission of data across an internet connection. Example of key management schemes. A popular example of a key management system is public key infrastructure, that is PKI, which is used in secure sockets layers, that is SSL and Transport layer security, that is TLS. Here is a representation of wireless sensor network. Here is a representation of data transmission analogy. In this representation, the sender sends the plain text. With the help of the encryption key, the plain text is being converted into the form of cheaper text. The chipper text is received by the receiver and the receiver views the chipper text. With the help of the decryption key, once again the receiver converts the original information in the form of plain text. This is represented here. Let us see the definitions of encryption and decryption. Encryption. The process of converting information or data into your code, especially to prevent unauthorized access. Decryption. The conversion of encrypted data into its original form is called decryption. It is the reverse process of encryption. Classification of key management systems. Based on the crypto system they used, Key management systems are classified into symmetric and asymmetric key management schemes. And based on the distribution methods, that is key distribution methods, it is classified into random key and deterministic key management schemes. The third classification is based on network topology. The key management schemes are classified into distributed key and hierarchical key management schemes. Symmetric key management. In symmetric key management, the encryption and the decryption key of the sensor node are the same, which is simple and it has a small calculation and the storage amount. Comparing with the asymmetric key, the symmetric key has an advantage in terms of computational complexity, but it is inadequate in the aspects of key management and security. Symmetric encryption is shown here. In this symmetric encryption, both the Encryption and decryption uses the same key. It is represented here. Asymmetric key management. Asymmetric key management has been considered unsuitable for wireless sensor networks, mainly due to its relatively high requirement for computing, storage, and communication capabilities of nodes. But with the gradual deepening of the relevant studies, some asymmetric encryption algorithms can now be applied in the wireless sensor networks. 
here is the representation of asymmetric encryption in this asymmetric encryption in the transmission side the recipient's public key is used but in the receiver side the recipient's private key is used that is the keys used in the transmission as well as reception are different this is represented here in the random key management scheme the sensor nodes get the keys from the key pool or multiple keys space by random sampling advantages of random key management scheme they are relatively simple way to get the key and the flexible deployment and its disadvantage is that there may exist part of useless key information in the sensor nodes in the deterministic key management scheme the sensor nodes calculate the determination probability to get the keys the advantages of deterministic key management are that it can obtain more accurate key and the session key can be established directly between any two sensor nodes its disadvantage is that flexibility of deployment decreases and the computational overhead of key negotiation becomes large distributed key management scheme in distributed key management the computation and the communication capabilities of sensor nodes are the same and the key negotiation and update are completed through the mutual cooperation between sensor nodes in the characteristics of the distributed key management is that the neighboring nodes collaborate to achieve key negotiation hierarchical key management in hierarchical key management network nodes are split into clusters and each cluster is composed of cluster head and ordinary sensor nodes the feature of management is that the requirement of computation and storage capacities of the common nodes is not too high but once the cluster head is captured by the attacker it will threaten the security of the entire network thank you very much for listening this lecture if you like this lecture means kindly share this video to your friends for further updates kindly subscribe my channel thank you